After nearly three decades of service, a battalion chief with the Clark County Fire Department is on his last shift. Yeah, a special ceremony honoring battalion chief Eric Poleski is underway right now. Hector Mejia live with a look at what's taking place at Warm Springs in 215. Hector, good morning to you. Good morning to you. And just moments ago, we showed you part of that ceremony here. Quite emotional, I'm sure. And I'm told that uh, Battalion Chief Eric Pulaski, you served your last 24 hours here. Just, yeah. you know, how do you describe, you know, what you felt as you were driving one last time here? Well, I, I don't think I'll be able to hold it together, but um, it's the end of my 27 year career here at, at uh, Clark County. Um, I've been in um, law enforcement and fire for 38 years now, and uh, this is my final day. My wife and I are retiring back to Michigan, where we came from, and it's uh, it's very moving to have all these folks show up and to say goodbye. You had no idea this was happening. This was a surprise for you this morning. I participated with the Honor Guard for many years, and, and I play the bagpipes for the department, and I've, I've participated in ceremonies like this, but I've always been... The person performing and honoring someone else, and uh, it was very difficult when the door went up. <laughs> what was running through your head when you were driving out? Just, it's it's just an honor to work here and work with all these folks, and um, it's a it's a happy day, but it's an emotional day too. You know, you were described as, you know, being one of the old school firefighters, a favorite among the department. Uh, you know, you would help anyone driving out, you know, and, and they're just selfless dedication. That's how you were described here just moments ago by some personnel. Uh, your last day on the job, you're heading home, and now you're going to do what? We, we have a new place in Michigan, and we've got some work to do there. Uh, my wife and I are definitely going to travel quite a bit. Um, we, we've, we're, we're very blessed to have worked for Clark County and, uh, and had a very good career, and, and we were well taken care of, so I want to thank the county for that. So we're going to travel quite a bit, um, hang out on the ranch, and I don't know, maybe I'll be bored in six months and I'll be looking for a new job, but for the time being, uh, that's, that's the plan, head back to Michigan and, and get some traveling done and kind of do whatever I want. So. Well deserved, sir. We are so lucky to have you, and thank you so much thank for your you so service. Much. We'll let you go back and uh, enjoy the ceremony with everyone else. But let me just show you a live look at the scene out here. Uh, before we let him go, we have such a display out here. We have dozens of firefighters, first responders, many of them. Uh, their career has been shaped by Battalion Chief Eric Pileski, and I'm told that he was joined by his wife here during the send-off, quite emotional, and again, it was all a surprise for him as he was just driving out out of fire station number 29, his last 24-hour shift. I'm told 27 years with Clark County Fire Department. Before that, he spent about five or six years with a fire department back home uh, where he came from in Michigan. Reporting live, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now. Oh, that is so sweet. A surprise to him, but we obviously knew about it yes. ahead of time. <laughs> <laughs> we got some a bit, of, a bit of a hint, but that's awesome to see. Thanks, Hector. Appreciate so that. Nice.